Asthma is a long-term inflammatory disease of the airways of the lungs. Usually asthma is diagnosed in childhood. But, sometimes it occur in adulthood. Classical symptoms of asthma include Episodes of wheezing, coughing, chest tightness, and shortness of breath. These may occur a few times a day or a few times per week. Adult onset asthma is asthma that develops as an adult, usually those over the age of 20. It can develop at any age. The symptoms of asthma in adults include Coughing with or without mucus, commonly coughing is dry. Especially at night or and in response on a specific trigger. For example, extreme weather or temperature. Exercise, pollen, cigarette smoke or other triggers. Tightness or pressure in the chest. Wheezing, a whistling sound when exhaling. Feeling short of breath. Feeling tightness or pain in your chest. Shortness of breath after exercise or physical exertion. Colds that go to the chest or hang on for 10 days or more. Colds that seem to linger. Coughing in isolation is usually associated with an infection, but the diagnosis of asthma should be considered if it is accompanied by wheezing, particularly at night. Recurrent respiratory tract infection should always raise the possibility of poorly controlled asthma. Diagnosis. In general, asthma is more likely to be the explanation if the presenting symptoms are recurrent or seasonal, worse at night or in the early morning, prompted by recognized triggers and rapidly relieved by short-acting beta-2 agonists. Auscultatory findings of wheezing, unexplained reductions in forced expiratory volume in one second, peripheral blood eosinophilia and or total immunoglobulin E level are supportive in making the diagnosis. Objective lung function response to inhaled beta-2 agonists remains the gold standard for diagnosis. Untreated asthma can contribute to even greater permanent loss of lung function. It's common for children to have asthma symptoms that come and go, for example triggered by allergy or a respiratory infection. Adult-onset asthma tends to have persistent symptoms that are often not associated with allergic triggers. About 1 in 10 adults with asthma have uncontrolled symptoms and exacerbations despite treatment. Such difficult-to-treat asthma can reduce quality of life and also lead to more deaths than we see with childhood asthma. Slow responses to appropriate therapy may occur in those with long-standing, poorly managed asthma as a consequence of airway remodeling resulting in a degree of fixed airways obstruction. Slow responses and absence of improvement should prompt a careful review for alternative diagnoses. Treatment of asthma in adults. The medications and treatments for adult asthma are Anti-inflammatories, inhaled corticosteroids are taken daily to prevent asthma symptoms by reducing airway sensitivity and inflammation. Steroid tablets can be taken for acute flare-ups and more severe asthma. Bronchodilators, Inhaled short-acting and long-acting bronchodilators are taken occasionally to relieve symptoms. They work within a few minutes and shouldn't be needed more than three times a week. Leukotriene receptor antagonists, daily tablets to improve prevention if needed. Theophylline, taken daily to prevent symptoms if they are still not well controlled. Monoclonal antibody therapy, also called biological medicines or biologics, these injections block some of the body's immune response to triggers. Bronchial thermoplasty is a surgical procedure done on the airway itself to reduce its thickness. Other factors can help controlling asthma. Have a seasonal flu vaccine and also pneumococcal vaccine to protect against pneumonia. If you smoke, get the help needed to quit. Maintain a healthy weight. Exercise regularly, eat healthily and get enough sleep. If symptoms arise when exercising, rest, use your reliever inhaler to recover before continuing.